draw today a French bulldog. All right, so we'll start with the nose first. Okay. And you'll start with the nose and start with the curve line up here. And then you can go ahead and bring it down a bit here. Just like that. We make a kind of like a U shape down here. Next thing cited, we're gonna draw an oval shape. Just like that. And then you can go ahead and shade the rest of the nose outside the oval. All right. So it should look like this. Next, we're going to draw a vertical line down here. And then a dot up top. Just like that. that that's going to be our guide for later. Now we'll continue drawing a curve line down here. Going to your right. And one to the left. So from the dot up here, we'll connect it down here from the curve up here, or well, let's just start from the top. Drag it all the way down to the curve line and connect them together. Then goes to the other side. You can go ahead and draw a line all the way down and together. And then draw three dots on each side, just like that. Next, we're gonna be the mouth part. For that, we're gonna draw kind of like a curve line U down here. And then you can go ahead and shade it. And the same curve line down here. Next, we're gonna draw his eyes. So we'll start from the right one. Go ahead and draw a big circle. Here. And to the other side as well. Parallel to the other one. Inside those eyes, you can draw two, two small circles. One, two, two in each. So one, two, and a curve line at the bottom. So go ahead and draw a curve line at the bottom inside those big circles, just like that. Then three lines down inside it. One, two, three. Same to the other side. One, two, three. Now we're gonna shade the outside of those two circles. So here we go. Carefully shade them. All right, now up top, we're gonna go ahead and draw another dot up here. That's gonna be our guide for making the face of the French bulldog. So we're gonna start from here and end right about um, here. 
So you can do a curved line here and on the other side as well. Like that, right. So from the dot all the way down to the right side of its cheek. And same to the left. Here you go. And two curve lines up top. It's eyes. Next will be his left ear. So with this, we're gonna draw a line up here. Continue it with a line deep down here. Kind of make a curve line like this. Decided to draw a curve line as well, just like that. Same to the right side. So again, line up, a little dip down, and a curved line at the bottom. And then a line inside. We'll make this trap on his face just like this. So one, two, just in between its eyes. Now for the body, we'll start to draw a curved line all the way down here, just like this. And the back from the middle of its face, all the way down there. <clears throat> Continue with the curved line down here. Another one next to it. And then connect them together. Then two lines for his box. We're gonna make four of this, so another one here. Make the line next to it and connect them together. Now for the back legs, we'll continue from the line here all the way down, parallel to the front leg, stop there, and then Make a curved line from here, just like that. It's the next connected to the belly, just like this. Another line down here. Go ahead and connect them together. And then draw two lines at the bottom. One more leg at the back. Kind of like an arrow shape right here. And then connect them. And do two lines. For its tail, we'll just you can make a curved line down here, kind of like a backward C. I'll just draw a heart right here. And then you can think of a name of your dog and you can write it at the bottom or maybe right here. Um, I'll write mine under his legs or oh, under his belly. So maybe Coco, Coco. My dog's name is Coco. 
Now for the details, we can add some grass. So I'm gonna put one in here. here as well. Mm. Let's take one the back. Top here, and then you can um, fill this up with grass. So all the way up here, you can draw a ball next to it too. So it looks like he's playing with a ball. Grass. And let's not forget our sun. I'll place it up here. Clouds. And birds. And of course, don't forget to write your name right here at the bottom. Here we go. That's my French bulldog named Coco. And I can't wait to see yours.